when it comes to New Year's Eve celebrations, some claim that the, uh, the celebration here at Times Square is the granddaddy of them all. In a little less than six hours, the clock will strike midnight and the celebration will be in full swing. Look at that handsome Fly man. From that Tim is Fleischer, our pal, Tim Center. Fleischer, high above Times Square in the closing hours in 1985. So debonair. That was Tim's first year at Eyewitness News. And for the next three and a half decades, you have been welcoming, welcoming him into your homes. Uh, today, Tim is announcing his retirement after a career that spanned more than 35 years of outstanding work at Channel 7, from anchoring to reporting to being one of the journalistic leaders in our newsroom. And Tom, Tim is the longest tenured member of our on-air family. And before before he says goodbye, we wanted to look back at what has been an incredible 35 years right here in New York. This is Channel 7 Eyewitness News with Tim Fleischer. It's called a dealer markup, and if anything for the consumer, it has been a lesson in economics. Joy Buttafuoco is trying to minimize his court time, and now investigators begin their painstaking process of piecing together the final moments of the flight. When the governor announced today that there were 10 new cases in Westchester County, Tim Fleischer has been a star on air for 35 years in the toughest market in the country. How did he do that? By being a tough journalist. So they're in there, they're warming up, they're, they're triaging. A fair journalist. The 480 employees are working three shifts and this plant is operating 24 hours a day. Why he's even a tech savvy journalist. The live streams appear right here at the top of the home screen. Thanks for staying up with us. I'm Tim Fleischer. And I'm Sandra Bookman. I don't Edith think I knew Beacon from Edison or any place in between. And being able to sit next to you on the weekends made me comfortable because I felt great sitting next to someone who had been here for decades. For now, the Metro cards are only good on the N and R lines. The MTA's Omni system has already recorded more than 5 million taps since the rollout of its contactless system. You knew the place, and you also could do everything. No matter whether it was breaking news or a feature, you were always very good at it. Important testimony coming today at the World Trade Center bombing trial. A very dramatic turn of events here in Linden uh, this morning with the capture of uh, Rahami, the suspect. Penn Station still locked and barricaded. It's caused a number of different problems. One of the biggest problems, let me show you over here, this is 8th Avenue. And my goodness, you have the energy, the curiosity, the work ethic of a 25-year-old. If you ever miss this biz, just remember all the adventures we had. Let me show you. We're going to walk around the corner here. I want to give you a peek down a side street here in New Rochelle. And you're going to see just how heavy the snow has been. In fact, I was going to give you the official measurement right now. We pulled the Eyewitness News ruler out, and yeah, we're at about about seven and a half inches. For three decades, Tim Fleischer was a larger-than-life figure on Eyewitness News, and he was hard to miss. But we're going to miss him now. The civil rights trial of Rodney King takes a dramatic turn today. That voice, that voice is the voice that you want telling any story. In some cases, the roads have to be blocked and traffic detour tonight. They were still bringing the injured over to this triage center. It's reassuring, just over my calming. No one has a voice like Tim Fleischer. We are all going to miss that deep Delta Blues baritone. Jim Dolan is following the trial for us and joins us live from Foley Square. Jim. Yeah, Tim, maybe the key pieces of evidence. But we're going to miss the smile more and the good word you always had more. We are going to miss your calming influence on a sometimes frenetic newsroom. Reporting live in Linden, Tim Fleischer, Channel 7. I would you. I'm Tim Fleischer. Thank you for joining us. Have a good night. So great Aww. to see you. Tim, the man, joining us now live. <laughs> Tim, I got to tell you, I have always looked up to you, and not only because you're the, one of the tallest guys here at the building, but because you set such a high standard for us all. Yeah, you certainly did. I mean, you've done it all. You've worked on every borough. Uh, you've worked here in New York City uh, and you actually helped kick off the whole Eyewitness News This Morning franchise. You mm -hmm. really have done it all and you've set the bar so high and we're so appreciative of everything you've done for us here and you've been a beacon for so many other journalists. So we are going to miss you profoundly, my friend. Thank you. I, you know, and I have to say that, you know, Art McFarland joined me uh, for Eyewitness News this morning, and the two of us have remained dear friends. I spoke to him just the other day as well. So 
it has been very overwhelming for me uh, in many respects because uh, I think a lot of viewers, you know, could resonate with the two of us, and I think that just carried on. You know, I, I have nothing but a great deal of thanks for all the many Channel 7 viewers. They are loyal to us, they come to us, they expect us to bring them the latest news, to, to, to bring them everything they need to know. And, well, Tim, uh, Tim, wait. And, and oh. I have to say, that Tim, wait, wait, but I, I've got to, I've got to get one other person in there because Bill Ritter could not oh, be here. Okay. He's off today and he had something to say to you. So let's take a listen. Everyone knew from day one that you could go out and get the story, no matter what kind of story it was. And you covered every kind of story. I don't know what we're going to do without you. I will tell you this much. You have one of the best voices to ever bless this television station. And we would imitate you. Sometimes we would say, I would say, I'm Tim Fleischer sitting in for Bill Butel. But I say that only one third as good as former sports anchor Scott Clark, who has also a very good voice. Scotty? I'm Tim Fleischer, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Back to you, Bill. So, Tim, we brought Scott out of retirement to wish you a good and healthy retirement. We're going to miss you, buddy. <laughs> so there you go, Tim. I had to interrupt you because Thank there's you. so much love oh pouring out gosh, there. Oh my gosh, that's okay. <laughs> so, so what do you? To what are you going to? Again, I, it's just amazing. So, what are you going to do next? What's the next chapter? Uh, I've got. I've got some video projects that I'm interested in doing. Uh, a lot of people don't realize I have a woodworking shop that I never spent enough time in. Oh. So I hope to do that as well. So uh, I've got, you know, I've got some things in the wings. Well, Tim, I just hope you take that snow ruler and you put it in a very special place because you don't have to do any more <laughs> snow coverage ever again. <laughs> you deserve your retirement. We're going to miss David, you. I, I, I've taken that snow ruler and thrown it. <laughs> <laughs> Bravo. It, you threw it, it for all gone. of us. <laughs> well, is there any one last thing, any one thing you wanted to say before we say our, our goodbye? Uh, I do. I, I want to thank, I, I, I want to thank all of our viewers because they have been uh, allowed us to come into their home, not only through the television, but when I knock on the door, you know, in the middle of the night, in the afternoon, uh, through thick and thin, they have always been there for us. And, you know, they'll open the door and it's kind of a, a, a surprise that I didn't expect to see you here, but they've always welcomed me inside to their homes. And that has been very special to me. Well, you're special, Tim, and we so appreciate you. What a career, 35 years. We're going to miss you, and we thank you for making the station better just by your presence. Wishing you all the best on your road ahead. Much love to you, Tim. Stay in touch, Tim. We'll talk when thank we'll you so right much. back. <laughs>